Starting in the name of Allah who is the most merciful, supreme and powerful. I am Mansur Hasan, your English teacher at Oxford Education Academy, Badkhela. Afaq Newson series, English for class 7th, unit number 2, The Miller, His Son and Their Donkey. Reading. The unit number 2, The Miller, His Son and Their Donkey. Reading which you come to the next video. Now, the first one is the carefully power of the 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 power दागे नम मिस्टेक्स चिकम दे आगोजी या दासी वर्ड्स पर की वीच अगर तासुल पारा न्यू भी दागे प्रेजेंटेशन में सासुज दक्की द्रेम ब्याब दागे वीडियो स्टॉप की आउ उखपल बाने में दागे लेसन रीड की खप गौर सरा मुकमल लेसन मरीड की नु कब ब्याब पर की हम दासी सब वर्ड्स वीच अगर तासुल मुश्किल भी when the reading sarasara chikala di kitaus to difficult word raji aga word taus part of speech patanevi ya taus aga word meaning na darzi no aga word zanta underline kawai next video ki bebe amunga da de meaning translation kaw the miller his son and their donkey once upon a time there was a miller who used to live in a little house beside his mill all the day he would work hard but would return home to his wife and his little son at night. One day, the miller made up his mind that he would take his donkey to the fair and sell it. So, he and his son said goodbye to their lady and started off. They drove their donkey very slowly, for they thought they would have a better chance to sell it if they kept it in good condition. As they walked along the highway, some travellers started laughing loudly at them. What foolishness it is to walk when they might have a donkey to ride on, cried one. The most stupid of the three is not the one you would expect it to be. The miller did not like travellers to be laughed at, so he told his son to climb up and ride. As they went a little farther along the road, Three merchants passed by. Oh ho! What we have here! They cried. Respect old age, young boy. Get down, and let the old man ride. Though the miller was not tired, he made the boy get down and climbed up himself to ride, just to please the merchants. At the next turnstile, they overtook some women carrying baskets loaded with vegetables and other things to sell. Look at the old fool, exclaimed one of them, he is sitting on the donkey while the poor boy has to walk. The miller felt a bit vexed, but to please the passers-by, he told his son to climb up behind him. They had no sooner started out again that a loud shout went up from another company of people on the road. What a crime, cried one. To load up a poor dumb animal like that. They look more able to carry the poor beast than he to carry them. They must be on their way to sell the poor thing's hide, said another. The miller and his son quickly scrambled down, and a short time later, the marketplace was thrown into an uproar as the two came along carrying the donkey slung from a pole. A great crew of people ran out to get a closer look at the unusual sight. The donkey did not mind being carried, but so many people came up to point at him and laughed and shouted that he began to kick and bray. Just as they were crossing a bridge, the ropes that held him gave way, and he tumbled down into the river. The poor miller now set out sorrowfully for home. By trying to please everybody, he had pleased nobody, and lost his donkey too.